So folks, have you heard the news? Donald Trump, the former US president, is in deep legal trouble, like a cow being led to the slaughter. Uh... <laughs> He's finally feeling the weight of reality knocking on his doorstep. Or is it the sound of handcuffs? <laughs> you see, Trump pleaded not guilty to 34 felony counts of falsifying business records. Can you imagine how he must have felt at that moment? The same guy who used to demand people open doors for him was standing in a New York courtroom with no one there to hold his hand. <laughs> I mean, Trump's legal troubles don't just end here. He's got lawsuits coming from Dominion Voting Systems, E. Jean Carroll, and New York's Attorney General. It's like legal thunderstorms for the sky. <laughs> Maybe we need an arc for all these cases. But the question is, how worried is he really? I mean, we know he cares more about telling stories to his base than, I don't know, the truth? But it seems like reality is finally catching up to him. We may just witness an epic showdown. Even Fox News isn't safe from the legal barrage and may have to testify in one of these cases, revealing what they really think of their favored former president. <laughs> I bet there are some very interesting conversations happening behind closed doors. And remember folks, if convicted, no Republican president can come to Trump's rescue with a pardon because state offenses aren't eligible for that sweet, sweet presidential pardon. Listen, we know he's terrified of confinement, but maybe, just maybe, this is the first day of the rest of Trump's life without enjoying any presidential immunity. <clears throat> well, folks, stay tuned for the next episode of The Unbelievable World of Trump and His Legal Woes. And who knows, maybe one day we will see Trump in... Prison? <gasps> Anyway, thank you for joining me today, and remember, when reality mugs Trump, it mugs us all! <laughs> this podcast is brought to you by iPicture...